everyone, and welcome to Old Joe the Crocheting Sailor. I am happy to come on today and show you something new from Jimmy Bean's Wool. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Okay, let's go ahead and open this thing up. This was packaged very nicely. You will be really surprised to see that this is a new maker's bag from Jimmy Bean's Wool. Their Q bag, it is packaged in their, their Lotus design. It says Q on it. Beautiful packaging. Look at this. A new maker's bag. And this is in the color red. Oh my goodness, look at this. Look at this bag. This is their new saddle bag. And I just knew you all would love it. It has a nice little tag on it. Oh my goodness. I went ahead and I put the stitch marker holder on so you can see. But let me go ahead and snip this off. This bag is $90. So for any of you that have not seen my previous videos and reviews on the Jimmy Beans wool canvas makers bags, you're missing out. So I would highly recommend that you go and check them out. I will make sure that I put the links in the description box below for the bags. The first one I did was a makers mini messenger bag that was $85. The second one I did was a maker's canvas backpack that was $125. And this is the new maker's canvas saddle bag for $90. So let's go ahead and open it from the back. As you can see, there is a nice pocket. It doesn't go all the way to the, to the bottom but it's enough for me to put my hand inside. My hand is not really small. So if you were traveling and you needed to put like a small wallet or your passport or something like that in there, something you can grab quickly, maybe even your keys, you could do that. Or if you wanted to put a credit card in here and you have this against your body, then you won't have to worry about anybody getting into that compartment. This is, if you notice right here, there is a magnetic closure at the top. I'll show you. This is a compartment. As you can see, it does have the Della Q in leather there with the emergency yarn cutter right there. And it goes all the way down to the bottom. This bag is a 12 by 12 inch bag. Okay, inside may be a little hard for you to see, but I will try to show you as much as possible. There are pockets in here. These three pockets that you see here, these three compartments is where you can put your knitting needles or your crochet hooks in. You can also put other things in there. There is a, a dot journal. And inside of it, you will see that there is a darning needle that they give you. That's included. So this is what the dot journal looks like life is what you make of it and down in that compartment is the strap so let me go ahead and connect this to the bag i love the construction of this bag and the time and effort they put into putting this together and thinking about how this would work for crafters crocheters, knitters, and the like. And this is adjustable. 
You see that? And I believe the last bag was about 69 inches. So this can work very well for anyone. So let's see what I can show you. This is how it's going to look. And this is a magnetic closure as well. Like I said, it's 12 by 12 inches. This is leather. Okay, it's gonna look better with time as you use it. I have been using my mini messenger bag all the time, every day. And it is perfect. And I'm using that as a regular bag, not just necessarily for crochet. So think about that also. So this is very, very nice. I love it. And like I said, you can adjust the straps. You can slide it. There we go. So you can slide it how you want and adjust it. This is beautiful. They do have blue, olive, mustard, salmon. And like I said, this is red, but the red is sold out for any of you red lovers. So let's go inside of the bag. So when you open the bag up, you will notice that there is a compartment right here that you can use to put a crochet pattern. And you enter it from this end. And this is Bearded Yarn Dudes. This is David Browning's channel and I used his free pattern. He has free patterns on Ravelry if you're interested. So I will put his channel information in here on the screen. If you would like to subscribe, check him out and check out his Ravelry. Then you'll see a zipper compartment right here. You see there is a yarn feeder right there and it's trimmed in leather and it goes all the way down to the bottom of the bag. Can you all see that? So I just grabbed a small skein of yarn. This is Premier yarn. But this is what I had handy and I put this down in the bottom and you can see you still have room for a full skein of yarn and several skeins that you can put in here. Can you all see that? Perfect. Okay, so now you can zip this up and you have a compartment right here on the outside. You see how far it goes down? It's very deep. Let's see if I can flip this back. Can you all see? Very, very nice. You can put several electronic devices in here. They really thought about that when they made this bag. Here is another compartment here. That is a magnetic closure. Can you all see that? Beautiful. That is a zip compartment. And I love the, the zippers. They just glide. And this goes all the way down to the bottom there. And you can put another device in there, a tablet if you like. You can put a little game. If you have children and they play games, you can put that in there and see how this magnetic closure just closes like so. You can turn it around has the Delacue logo in leather. Your pattern. And then you can close it right up. This is wonderful. This is something that I would love to use. This does come off, like I said, you can put other stitch markers on there. I was in a rush, so unfortunately, I didn't put extra stitch markers, especially the ones that people sent me. So my apologies on that, but I just was so excited to bring this to you and just show you this bag. 
this is magnificent inside of this main compartment the one that has the emergency yarn cutter it has a zip pocket which i did not show you so i will show you that unzip it put your hand in there it has the lotus collection logo throughout the bag on the inside and it is wonderful so i want to tell you now that i did order another one of these bags i want to thank jimmy beans wool for getting to the this to me right away they came out with this new design and informed everyone on friday and today is monday and i have this bag in my hand to share with you all so thank you jimmy beans wool for that i ordered a mustard today and it will be for a mother's day giveaway so it's going to be a mustard color mother's day giveaway this saddle bag this maker's canvas saddle bag so let me know in the comments what you think if you like this bag let me know in the comments Look at this. Look, it just glides with ease. So if you need to tighten it or loosen it, it's just perfect. I'm loving it. I love it. Look at that beautiful construction. The leather on one side and the canvas on the other. Wonderful. Thank you, Jimmy Beans Wool, again. Thank you all for watching. Make sure you check out my other, make sure you check out my other reviews on their products. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you all for watching and you guys have a wonderful and glorious day.